Welcome back to Let's Play Radius Senki. This is Big Los. And when we left off, we had just walked into Aguirre's village. And we had rested up, and we are still looking for the Stone of Flame. So let's go out and look for it. Now I'm wondering if Aguirre's is actually the name of these dinosaur creatures. Ah, maybe. Alright, let's check over here. That's where we came in, those stairs over there. And we do have another house and another... I guess I'll just call him a Gyrus. Pew! Alright, let's go in here and it looks like we got like a tool shop of some sort. Pia. What? You won't sell anything to me because I don't speak your language? You're kidding, right? And... Looks like we got another area up there, but then we got another house in... This direction? Anything up here? No? Alright, let's go up on inside. Oh, it looks like we actually got a human being. I think that's a human. Alright, let's sell some of the stuff that we got, like the bastard sword. Yeah, we'll sell the silk robe and the leather armor as well. And... We'll sell the... I guess we'll sell the, the fire sari and the water dress. Because we got a battle dress for Lee Arena. And we'll also sell the water ring. Yeah, space is kind of limited in this game. Yeah, we'll sell that cutter boomerang too. Right on. Now, do you have anything to buy? Well, we could get a Thunderclaw if we really needed one. Hayabusa. That's for Beru. And then he also sells some other things that we have or that we recently got rid of. Like, we got a full metal sword, so we don't need a bastard sword instead. In fact, we just sold it. So, let's equip this Hayabusa. Looks like we get a bonus of 5 points to defense when we equip the leather armor, but then we get an even better bonus. It's like a bonus of like 13. Alright, so we'll sell the leather vest once more. What about you? You won't sell anything to me because I don't speak your language. Okay, well, I don't think I want to buy anything from you. So let's go up up here, and there's a cave. And we got some treasure chests, so let's open them up. Alright, we got an elixir, and we got a travel bell. I think it's trying to, to tell us something. Oh, we obtained the Stone of Flame. Hooray! Let's take it back to King Ruji! Oh, we don't automatically go back there? Okay, why don't we use that item that we just got, the travel bill. Alright, and it transported us all the way to the palace. However, we gotta walk all the way there. If I remember correctly, I think we're gonna have to drop down this pitfall right here. And then make our way to the stairs over on the left. Yeah, just as I thought, we were ambushed by fire elementals. Try not to get too damaged by them.
Oh, looks like Lyrina's caught in a crossfire. Stop blocking me! Ah, oh, you keep blocking me! I'll remember that next time you need healing. Alright, let's make our way over to the left, to these stairs, and then we'll go up. Ah, we were almost there. Alright, let's just deal with these guys. It doesn't seem like they do as much damage anymore. In fact, it seems like they hardly do any. Alright, let's go up here. And let's avoid the pitfall. Oh, I was almost to the stairs. Alright, let's take out these scorpions. Ah, oh, the arena got poisoned. In. So did Los. Okay, well. It's no big deal. We're gonna get purifies at the end of this battle anyway. Oh, Lee Arena got poisoned again. You know what? I'm just gonna let her be for right now. Alright, now would be a good time to use it. Very good. Did that bring us back up to where we needed to be? No, just eight. It's okay, one more battle and we should be full again. Alright, hopefully we won't get ambushed when we go in here. So why are we bringing it back to this guy in the first place? Wow, you did it! Your Majesty, can we borrow the stone for just a bit? No! Oh no, I'm afraid not. I'm terribly sorry, but another guest needs it first. Betrayed. Greetings, Los. I'm Gaddis, the true heir to the Kingdom of Ark. It's Mr. Badass himself. Gaddis! I'm a busy man. Do you know the spell or not? No. Hmm. Well then, Ruji, I leave them to you. I'll take the Stone of Flame and go. Double-crossed, betrayed, wait! Oh no, there can be no interference, sir. Get them, everyone! And looks like we got his guard attacking us. So I'm gonna set everybody to attack a single individual. And uh, I think I'll have Lee Arena attack the guy on the right. And then we'll go after the two in the middle. Oh, they cast spells too, huh? Alright, let's try a... a... No, I, I want to use a silent herb. Where is it? Oh, there's one over here. I can't use it. Yeah, boss battle, you can't use any items or spells that would be remotely useful in these types of situations. No, your spells and your items are only good for... Ow. Just mundane monsters. That's so stupid, why? There's like no point to saving any of your spells if that's the case. Or your items. Uh oh, and Los's HP seems to be going down quite a bit. Might have to do something about that. Let's cast Heal Us. Now, I've never seen an enemy cast Heal Us, but... Uh-oh. Los gotta level up. 
If an enemy casts to heal us, then that would be pretty devastating, especially if it was like a boss. See, I think that screwed up. The bosses can cast spells, but we can't. Well, except for healing spells. Alright, we did it. Was it over quickly? Just like that, Ruji. You, you! You're... You're still alive? Well, well, Ruji. Shall we have an explanation? But please, sp spare me. You see, her? it's like this. What a coward! <laughs> but Gaddis got the stone of flame. Then it's all over for Gondia. Lee Arena. Yeah. Oh no! Did we get followed? We did. What's this? Obtained stone of flame. What? You mean we didn't have it before? It's the real stone! Dad, it's got a fake! Way to go, little guy! Thank you, Agira! Yeah, I guess those guys are called Agiras. Pew! Do you have anything else to say? No, you do not. Alright, let's go rest up and we'll save since we defeated those guys. Yeah, let's save in the first slot. Alright. So, everyone's level 13 except for Lowe's. He's 14. Well, I guess we're just gonna have to walk our way back all the way to Gondia. Fighting... God knows how many monsters. I guess since the music changed, there's no random encounters out here anymore. Doesn't seem like it. Oh, wait. Haha, <laughs> Ruchi's in his own cell. Better not escape. Ha ha ha, I fooled Akira. Dumb lizard. What? He hit the real stone? Oh crap! <laughs> that's... That's pretty funny dialogue. <laughs> okay, so Goddess was tricked. He's probably not going to be too happy about it when he finds out. But what does he need it for? I have no idea. Maybe it has something to do with the Radiant Tower. Undoubtedly so. So, looks like we gotta walk all the way through Burning Town Bandora. And then through the Lava Zone. I wonder if we can use another Travel Bell. Looks like this place is still deserted. I wonder what happened to everybody. Alright. So, let's try to use one of those travel bells. I can't use it. I guess we're gonna have to walk all the way back and deal with monsters. Oh, looks like we got something different from scorpions this time. We got mollusks, pinklets, and that that cast spells. And Darius gained a level. He was only 10 away when we saved. Alright, that's Barrow gaining a level. Yep. We still got quite a ways to go for Lee Arena, though. 
about 2,000, and we can train Baro for his final spell. It looked like it was called Spari. No idea what it does, but... Oh well, if it's an offensive spell, we can only use it during regular battles, not boss battles. See, that's so stupid. You should be able to use spells whenever you want. Why handicap yourself to melee weapons? I mean, this is like the only game I've played where it was like that. Every other time, if you get spells and you save them for a boss, you know, you're rewarded by having the battle a little bit easier. But not this game. No, you just can't use them whatsoever. And we get some more scorpions. Let's try to handle them. Yeah, we do have a poison ward on Darius, so he won't be getting poisoned anytime soon. All right. And we got too many purifies. And if I remember correctly, I think this was the way that we took. Yeah, this is going to take a while. Not going to be very eventful except for these types of battles. Ah, oh, Lee Arena got poisoned again. I should have given her the poison ward. She gets hit way more than everybody else. It's okay, we'll be able to use one of these purifies. Well, I mean, we'll get it back after we did use it. Ah, oh, and we got some more mollusks. Wow, you guys stop blocking me. Come on, attack! There you go. Oh, right, we get meat. We're gonna be stocked up on meat if we keep going at this rate. All right. Meat won't fit. Oh, I should have used some. All right, let's fill everybody back up to near maximum. Oh, that was a weird sound. All right. More scorpions. Yeah, watch out for those uh, stingers. All right, and it won't fit. Yeah, this is getting a little monotonous. I wish we could just go through this quickly. Go all the way back. What? Oh, okay, so that's what happens if you went the other way from the entrance. Well, it's a good thing I didn't go that way. So that means the entrance must be right below us. Alright, I guess there's an easy way to kill in these guys by just getting up, up, up against the screen and then being back a little bit. Uh, we got some more. I'll try not to forget to eat a bunch of meat before we kill the last one.
Oh, you bastard. But it hardly did any damage. Ah, oh, I forgot. Okay, let's... Let's use these meats. Sometimes I just get so caught up in these battles that... I try to revive myself and I still forget. Oh man, it's getting slow again. Alright, hold on a second. I think that fixed it. Always oh, around 20 something minutes. Let's see, no monsters in here, right? I guess not. Alright, now we gotta take the long trek all the way back to Gondia. That means we gotta go down through these foothills, and then we gotta go through that forest. Alright, well, uh, at least killing these guys is a lot easier. No, that's a dead end. I forgot. Oh. And we're gonna have a meat drop in this battle, so I'll try to remember to heal up before we kill the last one. Yeah, these guys really don't do a lot of damage to us. Unless you're caught in a crossfire like Darius. Alright. Finally remembered. There we go, and we should be back up to full after this. Alright. Yes, I haven't forgotten where we are. Oh, we take one step and we're ambushed. I think these are different hornets. These are dark green hornets than the ones we fought earlier in the game. They still go down rather easily, though, and don't do a lot of damage. Hey, take two steps and you're ambushed once again. Well, at this rate of encounters, we should have the arena leveled up before not too long. Ah, oh, I forgot to heal up before the end of the battle again. And this time we got some goats and some purple slimes. Yeah, let's just take these guys out. These guys aren't dangerous at all. Unless you're Lee Arena. And we get Tusk times three. I wonder if that's for each monster. No, we, we literally got three tusks. And we're probably going to get more in this battle, too. Forest of Godo. I haven't really noticed that before. Whoa. And it looked like I was about to completely miss him, too. Right, let's go. Okay, this time we got hornets of two different colors. We got some blue ones and we got some forest green colored ones. The blue ones go down very easily. These green ones are a little bit tougher. Yeah, and we're gonna use up these meats. 
yeah, we're, we'll do one more. There we go. Before the end of the battle, because we'll get refilled right after it. Oh, and Leorina couldn't help but get herself hit, huh? Okay, we should be near the entrance. Now, I recall that we didn't go to the north and we didn't go to the west at this crossroads, so we're going to do that right now just to see if we missed anything. Because I had no idea where I was going. I just happened to take the right path. And it's kind of a weird coincidence that I chose the right way to go, but oh well. That just makes it so that if there was any dead ends, I don't know about them. So let's go up here first, see if there's any treasures or anything. No, once again we're ambushed. And we're gonna get another tusk collection out of it. Fortunately, they don't last very long in battle. Well, the purple slimes kind of do, but not the goats. So we're in a clearing, and there seems to be one large tree, and then it leads to a dead end. So we're going to have to go back. Uh, but not before being ambushed again by the exact same enemies. I guess it's better than just fighting pictures of the enemies with a back background, and you know what game I'm talking about. Alright. Next, we're gonna go west. And this high encounter rate makes this rather tedious. Yep, and there's some more purple slimes. I believe the drop purifies because they do have a poison attack. And it looks like Learina was the victim of it. Ah, oh, man, I should have used it. Alright, well, let's use it on her right now. We'll get another one soon enough, and that's a dead end. I should have known. Okay, this time we won't get a purifier, we're just gonna get tusks. Hey, at least those things make us rich, though. Even though we don't use them. I wonder why they're valued so highly. The tusks, I mean. I mean, I'm just curious about their whole economy. I mean, I can understand why meat would be valuable, but... A tusk that does a poison attack? That doesn't seem very valuable at all to me. Unless they use it in some sort of medicine. Maybe I'm thinking about this too much. You know, maybe I'll turn my brain off a little bit while I'm playing. Alright, and let's take care of this last guy, and then we'll go back down, which I think leads us to the mansion without having to deal with any enemies. Finally, that's what this whole episode is about. Just getting from where the Stone of Flame was back to the mansion. And then we're going to have to save again and start a whole new episode. Alright, so let's work our way to the bed. What the? Why are we being attacked in here? What gives? And we got a purple magician this time, or a purple wizard. Uh-oh. And those attacks are stronger than ever.
And we only got 480 gil out of it? Very well, we'll go into the bed and... What do you have to say, Sophie? What happened here? Why are there monsters? I'll look after him. Be careful. So you have no idea why there's monsters here. And we can't wake up Hammond yet. Well, I guess we'll go into the bed and we'll save the game. And we'll continue because I think we have to go into the town to use the Stone of Flame. So let's work our way over there. You're kidding me! I mean, we gotta deal with these wizards now because we got the Stone of Flame and they've invaded this place? Without any explanation as to what happened? It's just something that's trying to stop us. All right. And we got some more gold. Man, I can't even take like two steps. This is just ridiculous now. Did they really mean for it to, uh... Get really hard and try to stop us? I guess they did. Can we make it out the door? Alright. Are we gonna get attacked here, too? Well, I hope not. That was kind of weird. Why did monsters all of a sudden spawn inside the mansion? With no explanation. Well, I hope there is an explanation. Alright, and I think we have to go to the center of the town, which I believe was that fountain that those two weapon stores and the two item shops are surrounding. I mean, I think. I don't know. I don't think they really said where to go. Well, no monsters so far, so that's good. And you know what, we could rest up in this inn, but I think we're actually pretty close to our destination. No, I guess the Stone of Flame won't wake you up. Well then, what are we supposed to do? You know, they never really said what the thing is for anyway. Okay, and let's trigger a cutscene. No, no cutscene. Okay, let's go this way. No cutscene, huh? Let's ask for advice. Alright, let's go back to Gondia, and we're here. If we place the stone on the altar of water, on the top floor of Daddy's mansion, the ice will melt. Aw, oh, you gotta be kidding me. You mean I gotta go all the way back there? I do, don't I? Alright, well, I guess we'll meet you back here in a few minutes. Alright, and we're back in the mansion, so let's just go up and save the game. But not before we are ambushed once again by these purple wizards. And it won't let us trick them because they're too smart for that. Good thing that they don't take too many hits to kill, they just deal a lot of damage. Alright, that should do it, so let's go on up and we'll go into the bed and we'll save the game, and then I guess we'll place the Stone of Flame on the altar in the next episode. Will it save the town? Find out next time! This is Big Low signing off. Thanks for watching. See you next time, and Tango Umwendia.